Sir Tazati Sargsyan is an Armenian politician who served twice as the Prime Minister of Armenia and was the third president of Armenia from 2008 to 2018. He won the February 2008 presidential election with the backing of the ruling Republican Party of Armenia, a party in which he serves as chairman, and took office in April 2008. On the 18th of February 2013, he was re-elected as president and served the entire term. Despite pledging in 2014 not to become prime minister again while supporting an amendment of the constitution in 2015 that would allow it, Sargsyan was again elected prime minister of Armenia in April 2018. In what opposition figures described as a power grab, six days after taking office, Sargsyan resigned after large-scale protests. Sargsyan is currently the leader of the Republican Party which from 1995 to 2018 held a majority in Armenia's National Assembly. Sert Sargsyan. In addition to his native Armenian, he is fluent in Russian and also knows Azeri. He is not related to the former Prime Minister of Armenia, Tigran Sargsyan, or current President of Armenia Armin Sarkisyan. Starting in 1979, held several positions in the Stepanakert Komsomol Committee, first as division head, then second secretary and first secretary. He then became the He Stepanakert City Committee Propaganda Division Head, the Nagorno-Karabakh Regional Committee Communist Organization's unit instructor, and finally became assistant to Jenra Poghosyan, the first secretary of the Nagorno-Karabakh Regional Committee. As tensions rose between Armenians and Azerbaijanis over the issue of Nagorno-Karabakh, Sargsyan became the chairman of the Nagorno-Karabakh Self-Defense Forces Committee in 1989. He was elected to the Supreme Council of Armenia in 1990. From 1992 he chaired the Nagorno-Karabakh Republic Self-Defense Forces Committee, which formed the basis for the NKR Defense Army. From 1993 to 1995 he served his first term as Armenia's Minister of Defense under President Lewon. Ter Petrosyan. In 1995 he became Minister of National Security of Armenia and from 1996 to 1999 he concurrently served as Minister of Interior. In February 1998, Sargsyan, along with then Prime Minister Robert Kocharyan and Defence Minister Vazgan Sargsyan, forced President Ter Petrosyan to resign in order to prevent him from accepting a peace plan for the Nagorno-Karabakh conflict put forward by international mediators in September 1997. The proposal envisioned the return of most of the Armenian-occupied territories surrounding Nagorno-Karabakh to Azerbaijan in exchange for security guarantees, but left the final resolution of the status of Nagorno-Karabakh for future negotiations. From 1999 to 2000 he served as the chief of staff for President Robert Kocharyan and then served once again as the Defense Minister of Armenia from 2000 to 2007. He was also the Secretary of the National Security Council led by President Kocharyan from 1999 to 2007. On 4 April 2007 Sargsyan was appointed as the Prime Minister of Armenia, following the sudden death of Andranik Magaryan. Sargsyan, with President Kocharyan's backing, was viewed as the strongest contender for the post of the President of Armenia in the February 2008 presidential election. Full provisional results showed him winning about 53% of the vote. A first-round majority, well ahead of second-place candidate Lewon Ter Petrosian. The 2008 presidential election was hailed as largely democratic by OSCE, the European Union and Western Monitors. Ter Petrosian's supporters disputing the official results, held large protests in Yerevan for over a week following the election, until they were violently broken up on 1 March. Ten people were killed, and a state of emergency was imposed for 20 days. Ending on 20 March 2008, Sert Sargsyan was sworn in as president at the Yerevan Opera House on 9 April. Referring to the painful events that followed the election, he urged everybody to look forward. Together, to seek and find the way for reconciliation, development, and future of Armenia. He appointed Tigran Sargsyan, 
who had been the chairman of the central bank and is not a member of a political party. As Prime Minister, according to the Freedom House report, in 2011, the government took concrete steps to fulfill long-standing and often repeated promises to confront corruption, a government services reduced opportunities for bribery, while new regulations and stricter enforcement led to higher numbers of corruption lawsuits and fines against senior officials and large companies. Owing to a more consolidated government effort to eradicate corruption, Armenia's corruption rating improved from 5.50 to 5.25. During Sargsyan's presidency the record of the freedom of speech and the freedom of press in general also improved in Armenia. Internet penetration rose sharply, from 6.2% in 2008 to 37% in 2011, providing greater access to online media, which rapidly grew in number, including blogosphere, wit, 